Aries, hello and uh, welcome back. This is going to be a reading for mid of uh, September for you. And um, let's see, Aries, let's see what you can expect this period. Wish fulfillment as always, wish fulfillment as always. And you have to get um, the best out of uh, what you can. I'm saying this because in every reading, almost almost every reading, we see wish fulfillment, wish fulfillment. I hope that uh, you have made already, see, you have made already most of your dreams, uh, you have seen them coming true. And if not, I'm here always to help you do it. Okay, again, um, for this period, I'm not going to have a second part of the reading. That's it. That's so beautiful. The Ace of Swords and the Ace of Cups for you. Always, always, there is always. And um, let's start. Let's see. You will have clarity. You're going to have news that will make you so happy. So happy. Seriously, so happy. Something is hidden, or you try to hide something. Um, that's something that uh, for you that could have been into a marriage has to do something with your past. For you that have not, it could be any kind of engagement. Yes, yes, the past is somehow alive for you, and probably you are moving away from your past. But let me see, it could be also a person from the past that you haven't. Uh, seen him or her uh, you know life parted ways and you haven't seen him or her for a long time no it, it can be it can be something from the past the reconciliation but uh, or a huge awakening a huge transformation that look this is yours Aries but your future okay this is yours the ace of cups as I told you I have uh, I had this feeling when I started the reading that you have to use the best out of this period every time i i'm saying to you wish fulfillment you have to see all the opportunities around you and uh, grab them all okay maybe some are amazing some are not that amazing but you have to you have to the sun the sun and the three of cups the happiness, more happiness. You can be very, very happy. Very, very happy. What is coming to you? You don't know stability and success. You're hoping that something will come and it will change everything. If you don't hope for this specific person to enter your life and bring you love, and you have the financial uh, prosperity, success, and the career that you want, it should be from that person that wants to change the dynamic between the two of you or in his or her life so that it will enter you and uh, show you his or her love. Let's have a potential outcome. <laughs> Every time I pull out this card, you should see my face. What can I say to you? I, 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 I started the reading with wish fulfillment. And I'm saying to you, every time, this is your card. Every time, Aries, come on. It's coming to you and you have to see. You have to see this opportunity. You have to make your dreams to come true. You have to understand what is going on around you so that you're not going to miss any chance any opportunity of course you will be all or nothing uh, lots of fire inside of you lots of determination inside of you to go and make it 
And if you ever need help, okay, I'm, I'm always here for a private reading or something. So to show you the way how to have this Nine of Cups, how to have this wish fulfillment. So far, so far, okay, something is hidden. You're going to have a huge awakening news that will make you extremely happy and uh, will support you a lot. Stability at uh, the energy that is coming and you don't know happiness around this period and the beautiful wish fulfillment there is. The beautiful wish fulfillment. Let me see your past. As I told you, should have been for some of you something uh, Oh, something with uh, your marriage if you had been having if you had been uh, if you had been in a, in, a, in a marriage or in a commitment commitment could be in a love relationship in a business relationship that you have felt this is the, the most beautiful things that that's why sometimes you know I'm going crazy with uh, with the cards and I adore I adore Taro I just adore Taro here's your past ace of cups abundance in your life two of cups love but we have seen that the ace of cups that you didn't have in the past and i'm saying to you why you didn't have it, have it in the past is coming to you at your future and i'm saying to you why because you had this card you had a determination that to drive that thing, even impulsiveness sometimes you know to make it happen but disappointed you a lot a lot it was not what you had been expecting to be and you thought that it would be once and forever once and for all and uh, and forever and never and never and it was not and it was not and uh, why I love the cards because I can show to you at least how they speak to me the ace of cups that you didn't have it in the past and you had been disappointed is coming to you in the future that same determination that you had in the past will be all around you during September mid of September what more to say let me see what is hidden let me see what is hidden or maybe you try to hide something and I'm saying to you that, okay, you are not uh, doing something wrong. Actually, it is, um, I would also advise you to keep things hidden. <laughs> Damn it. At your focus, the clarity, yes, the news, yes, strength, a new project, a new idea can be sexual relationship, but Again, the Ace of Cups. Let me see your past. It is yours, Eris. It is yours. It is yours, for God's sake. It is yours. So, I told you that here we are talking about the past, right? The happiness that you thought that you are going to have, but you didn't have. Okay, you have done wrong, wrong uh, choices. You took the wrong decisions. Okay, everyone is doing. So don't blame yourself about this. But here comes the past. And I'm going to tell you that the Ten of Cups from the past, and here is also your past, that your strength is clarified by the Ten of Cups double happiness the, the happiness that you didn't have in the past that you thought that you would be having actually was a lesson in your life to make you extremely strong it was difficult and maybe some of you still haven't um, you, you have not overcame yet all this energy from the past but you have the ace of swords now add your strength you're going to do it and you, from all the lessons from the past everything that you have taken from the past you can use it as a lesson so to move on and have what finally your ace of cups
coming out of loneliness. Definitely. Even um, something at your work, uh, regarding your friends, regarding partners, you're going to have a realization that something that has delayed a lot, a lot, you can overcome it. I see here both a balanced areas in love, in money, in career, and taking the right decisions. Yes, you're going to be in a crossroad, but you have to choose something but you will have this awakening where you should take your life don't forget we have abundance here we have everything that you hope for is coming to you is coming to you and you being very happy around this period with love love will come to you from a person huh? that uh, uh, love will come to you from a person that was somehow a little bit stuck. Didn't take a, uh, the first step to come and knock your door and say to you, Aries, okay, let me allow me to show you my feelings. But I see a connection here that is going to be very lustful, very sexual, very strong, very passionate. And most of everything, most of everything. What I love in this connection is that, Aries, you need no one. You can just rely upon yourself. And when you have all this power and energy, it will be like the divine time to have what is meant to be yours and it will make you very happy and this can also include a financial proposal that will make you extremely successful let me see what i love to see always the energy that is coming to you and you have absolutely no idea about this Fate, huge awakening, a new beginning that finally will bring you the justice in your life, finally will bring you what you deserve. And all this energy is crowned by the six of wands, victory and triumph. Look, um, Aries, we don't see such kind of energy every day, okay? We don't, we don't. Something huge is coming to you. Yes, for some, for some of you, something will come uh, as a result from a court case, okay? Something legal that maybe you have been waiting for or trying to solve and will be solved. Victory is yours is here. Fate is here. Success is here in a complete new beginning. You will know, you will take, as I'm saying to you, you will take the right decision where to take your life from this point and on, that you're going to be very, very happy. Huge transformation, huge, huge, huge awakening. You had been patient, you had been waiting and uh, things had been delaying in your life. Now we'll start to take the right place and it will bring justice into your life bring balance into your life you're going to have what you deserve and even more I can see that even more with the six of Pentacles even more you're hoping about this right you're hoping about this to destroy all the, the energy from the past to leave the past behind hmm. that will make you very happy and you're hoping that uh, something will happen I always say that um, the tower can be very, very good 
is not always difficult. Most of the times I would say that uh, it is like um, a relief for people. Something will happen like a divine intervention, the past will be gone and you will enjoy all the pleasures of life, worry-free and even uh, breaking the chains from the past. Yes, this can also include some kind of trip abroad or a person abroad, some kind of relocation. This is Allow me to see one more card here, or two or three. This is crazy. This is crazy. This is, ah, oh God. This is crazy because for the third or fourth time we see judgment. Of course, a new beginning here, but will come into your life a person that can make you the most happy that you can be, but will not be the person. Unfortunately, we don't have a second part, so I would say to you even more and analyze their characters, their feelings, their actions, and result towards you. But there is. There is coming to you a person that is, has a name and a face and is the king of wands. That is supposed to... Maybe already you'll feel like uh, is your dream person. You want this person. You desire this person for whatever. Could be vice versa, okay? In this general reading. But... But... That person... Is just fake. It will uh, promise you empty promises, will give you empty promises, can't even tell you lies. It will make you live in a, in a nice, beautiful, pink, beautiful cloud, but it is nothing else than uh, a bubble that at some point you will understand that it was just daydreaming. It was false. That's it. This person is uh, obsessed with you. Is obsessed with you. Can also be very toxic as a relationship. What is amazing is that the understanding, the new beginning, uh, that awakening, that transformation, I told you, you have to decide where your life will take you. And you have to decide between the King of Cups, the King of Wands. I always saw, I, I said about King of Cups because we also saw King of Cups here. Between the King of Wands and the Emperor. Let's say that the real deal is the Emperor. The Emperor. The King of Wands could be obsessed with you. The King of Wands can uh, can say to you everything that you need to hear, so that uh, you know to have sex with you. But it's not the right one. It was. It's just an illusion. If you feel that you are going to be happy with the King of Wands, you are going to be happy with the Emperor. What is interesting is that there is a huge possibility that this person will say to you, do you know Aries, let's get married. Let's get committed to each other. Pardon me, but it's a little, it's a huge BS here. Huge, 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 huge. You just know. He's saying to you lies. And you will have the clarity, you will have this awakening. You will understand that the real one around this period that can make you very happy appears to be the Emperor. That's why you have to decide. 
I don't worry at all about you. Why? Because I see the triumph, I see the happiness, I see the wish fulfillment. It's just that, uh, and I see that you're going to have the clarity so that you will wake up. You will open your eyes and see who is who. If you don't, if you cannot, the advice will come to you from a hair fund. As I told you in the beginning that uh, always there are persons to help you to give you advice. So if this is a spiritual person, for example, okay, is a tarot reader, is a priest, is a, a psychologist, is someone that can advise you. If you cannot see clearly who is who and what can bring into your life, you can have advices. But no matter what, that person is fake, the real one is the emperor is the emperor i love again that i see wish fulfillment i love the fact that we have seen three times two or three times the ace of cups abundance is coming your way wish fulfillment is coming your way victory and triumph sex passion drive everything everything you can have and most of everything for some of you the most important is that you have now the power the desire you had but now you also have the power and the way to get out of past traumas, heal may even past traumas and move on in your life. Then you're going to take a decision between those two persons, minimum, minimum, because you know that many, many times uh, in the extended readings, we see, the, um, we see that more persons are involved that don't appear here more persons are involved for example you i see the connection between you and the king of wands and finally if you will be with the king of wands there will come another person that will say what am i going to lose aries so we'll get in between the connection of you between you and the king of wands king of swords for example that doesn't appear here because this moment right now is not present but when things will move on between you and this one then many more persons can enter your life uh, this we see many times we have seen many times uh, during uh, second parts but anyway i see that the decision you have to take around this period between two persons king of ones and the emperor emperor is the one that you should choose so Aries, this is what I was having for you for mid of September. Again, I'm saying to you, don't miss any opportunity. If you want to listen to me, take my advice, I, I would be the happiest to help you and uh, make you understand that you should not miss because it's an amazing period, especially now uh, that uh, every, the things start rolling anyway. Uh, the way that it should so again appear so many opportunities in front of you Choose the right one. Okay. In any case. Thank you so much for watching this reading I'm sending you all my hugs all my kisses. Take care. We'll talk soon very 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 soon in any case Thank you again. Take care and uh, bye for now